My last name is Canna Fanny, like a can of Fanny. As you can imagine, I get made fun of a lot. I'm called by it by every teacher who's brave enough to ask its pronunciation, and when the kids of my class hear it, it's what they start to call me. Kids I've had, friends I've had for three years still don't know my first name. And it always starts the same way, too. Teachers will call roll, and then they'll get to my last name, and they'll either skip it or they'll butcher it. And then I have to go through the humiliation of saying Canna Fanny aloud. And of course, all the kids snicker in their seats with their simple names while well, I'm from then on branded as Canna Fanny for the rest of my days. And even at the beginning of this year, when I told my English teacher how to pronounce it, she replied with, and I quote, well, that's unfortunate. I've always had a secret hatred for my mom marrying a man with the dreadful last name Canafani. It's a cruel thing to do to your children and a plight I'll have to live with till I'm married thanks to her. I was planning on changing when I turned 18, but my mom won't let me. She says it'll be too difficult with all my college and information forms. I think it's because she feels bad that my younger sister will have to keep it three years longer and that if one of us two older sisters changed it that it would be unfair. I don't care. I had to suffer with this last name for 18 years. I shouldn't have to longer than that. Doesn't matter though. This name will haunt me till I die because it's how everybody knows me. Just because you change your last name doesn't mean everybody will magically forget. I know that when I go to my high school reunion, everybody is still gonna call me Canna Fanny. And that's not the worst of it either. <clears throat> the worst of it came in 2005 because in 2005, Hurricane Katrina hit. Guess what my first name is. <laughs>